Hey guys, welcome to the video and happy Friday morning. <laughs> oh, it's Friday, all right. Um, we're talking today about fasting um, for 12 hours overnight, who's doing it, why we're doing it, and getting a little bit nerdy here, okay? So if we haven't met yet, by the way, I'm Tara. I'm a registered nurse and certified as a health coach, a nutrition coach, and a personal trainer. So I help women get healthy, fit, and strong. Uh, that's what I do for a living. So it's awesome. It's the best job in the whole world um, because I get to change people's lives for a living. So it's amazing. Hi, whoever's joining, please say hello. Let me know in the comments if you're here, if you're watching the replay, where you're watching from. Okay, so some of you guys may know that, and if you're on my email list, you just got an email from me, um, my Transform Body and Mind six-week group coaching program for women looking to lose fat in a healthy and sustainable way kicks off on Monday. But today is the last day to get in on that, and that's because the, everybody will actually be getting their first email on Sunday morning um, so that they have a day to kind of wrap their head around what's going to be going on with the nutrition protocol. They're going to get their fitness protocol on Monday, and then we do our first live coaching call on Monday night, um, and we take it from there. It's going to be six weeks of awesomeness. Um, we're going to get healthy from the inside out. Fat loss is going to happen as a side effect, right? So when you're not focusing on it, when you're really focusing on balancing your body and you're focusing on becoming healthier from the inside out, um, that's something that happens, right? As a side effect. If you've got some excess body fat, that's going to go away as well. So one of the things that we're going to be doing in Transform is going, uh, we're going to be working up to going 12 hours overnight without eating. So fasting for 12 hours overnight. Now, why 12 hours? Well, 90% of people, of Americans, I don't know if this is, I don't remember if the study was across the globe or I think it was just Americans, 90% are not going 12 hours overnight without fasting, right? So most people are eating way, way, way more frequently. And while eating is good for us, we want to nourish our bodies, we want to bring in the nutrients we need, we need to eat and that's all good. It's not good if we're doing it all the time and we don't give ourselves a break. So it would be like going to the gym, you know, working out is good for you, but you're not going to go lift weights for 22 hours a day, right? You need to give your muscles a, a break and that's when things regenerate. So you don't actually get stronger when you're in the gym working out. You could be at home, whatever, but you're not actually getting stronger when you're doing the workout. You're actually creating a little bit of stress. You're creating little micro tears inside your muscles, what you're really doing. Um, but it's the recovery process. It's the time in between your workouts when your body is then rebuilding and getting stronger. The same idea um, is surrounds the whole eating thing. We need time off from eating so we can truly um, get really efficient at uh, metabolizing our food and extracting all of the nutrients. So it's great to eat. I'm a pro proponent of eating, right? Awesome. Um, but how often are we eating? That's a big a big clue as to how out of whack things are for you. So if you're eating all the way up until you go to bed and then you wake up and you eat breakfast first thing in the morning and you know, let's say you're giving yourself eight hours where you're not eating, the recent studies and tons, tons of research is showing that that's actually not the best for us. Um, it throws off our blood sugar, it throws off our ability to heal itself. So um, for so many reasons, it's great to give your body a little bit of a rest. Your gut has a chance to heal itself if you're having a little issue with leaky gut syndrome, uh, which is just intestinal permeability. Um, so your intestines are supposed to let small molecules through, but sometimes for a number of different reasons, it ends up becoming more permeable and it's letting larger molecules go through and your body starts attacking that and that's where you can have all kinds of autoimmunity symptoms and things like that. So for so many reasons, giving our body a break overnight is, is really important. Yes, you can still drink water, um, but you're, the aim is to not take in anything that has calories at all um, because then your body will have to process it and digest it. So. A 12 hour overnight water fast could do some people do well with a little bit longer than 12 hours sure absolutely there's so much science between all of it but it's a it's a fine balance and beyond 12 hours much beyond 12 hours you have to start to look at the individual um, what they've got going on their current level of health activity their goals things like that because if you do it for too long and you stress things out too much um, women in particular can start to 
um, lower their sensitivity to thyroid hormones, so then the thyroid can be thrown off. So I'm not saying that nobody can do it longer than 12 hours, but 12 hours seems to be about that time frame where it doesn't seem too difficult to implement, right? If you just stop eating from like 8 p.m. to 8 a.m., that's not too difficult for most people to get to. Um, and it seems to be at a point where it's pretty healthy for most of the population without having to get into those nuanced um, you know, health history situations, right? So I'm speaking here to not one person, but to whoever's watching the video. So for the most part, most of you watching this video would improve your health by going about 12 hours overnight. I have to say, check with your healthcare provider, right? Because I'm not your healthcare provider. Um, so that's why we're doing it. We're gonna get healthy from the, hi Kimberly, thanks for watching. Um, we're gonna be getting healthy from the inside out and transform, right? So this is a six week program for women to get stronger, um, get healthier and to lose excess body fat. The excess body fat is just the symptom. When we're getting healthier and rebalancing ourselves from the inside out, that's actually what's going to be the focus, and then the excess body fat goes away with that. So we've got a nutrition protocol, we've got a five minutes of fitness a day protocol, um, and then we're gonna be getting deep into mindset stuff, and why? Because if I just told you here, this is the protocol, follow it, go 12 hours overnight fasting, um, balance your plates in these ways, and here's your portion sizes, okay, go, um, most people are not gonna find a lot of success with it, which is why a lot of people have tried many, many different diets, and then they've failed, and um, they keep trying things after, after trying things, because most people, you tell me what you find, but most people are not discussing mindset. Most people in the nutrition and fitness field have not gone to school for psychology and behavioral change and those types of things. So usually you'll find something that's just about nutrition, just about fitness. Maybe you'll be lucky enough to find something that's nutrition and fitness combined, but then they're not addressing the actual mindset about how to change a behavior and routines and um you know, how our, our thoughts affect our feelings and our feelings affect our actions and our actions affect our results. These things are all tied together. So if I just tell you the benefits of fasting for 12 hours, it doesn't mean that you're gonna be able to stop the nighttime snacking or binging, right? It doesn't mean that you're not going to um, struggle with feeling like the food is in control of you, which is what a lot of people are telling me. So that's why we're gonna address all of it. 360 degree view here in the six week program. I'm so excited. Today's the last day to sign up. Um, the other thing I wanna mention about fasting, cause a lot of people will say that they um, do things like they take in exogenous ketones um, during their fasting window. So that's something, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, <laughs> just forget it. Um, but this is something that's kind of up and coming. It's on the rise now. There's a lot of these MLM companies um, that are, you know, having people do direct sales for these drinks. They're usually drinks that contain extra ketones in them. So rather than just putting your body in ketosis from what you're eating or, or not eating and when you're eating, um, this is like saying that when you, when you take these ketones and you're fasting, you won't have the same level of appetite and you'll be able to go a little bit longer. Here's the thing I wanna say about that. Hey, Joni, thanks for joining. Here's the thing I wanna say about the exogenous ketones, okay, or those supplements that you take with ketones in it. Um, I'm trying to think of how to say this where I don't get too science nerdy and lose you. Basically, ketones will break down into something called butyrate. Butyrate breaks down into coenzyme A, and coenzyme A will stop a lot of the benefits of what you would get for fasting. So all you need to know is taking in the, the outside ketones, like from a drink or a supplement, will actually stop your body from so many of the benefits that you would get from fasting. So I don't recommend it. There, there could be cases where you might wanna take that in for other things, um, certainly neurological um, and brain trauma, those types of things, Alzheimer's, the research out there is showing that that stuff is really beneficial um, for your neurological system and a lot of other things. So you, that might be part of somebody's treatment, for example. But I'm not talking to you guys about treatment, right? We're talking about just optimizing our health, living long lives, um, you know, being full of good energy, having confidence, losing the excess body fat. So when it comes down to that, I would not recommend that you take in those extra, those exogenous ketones through a drink or a supplement during your 12-hour fasting window. Um, the, the main benefits of fasting are two things called uh, apoptosis and autophagy. Okay, sorry guys, I really, <laughs> I hope some of you guys listening are nerds like me and you wanna hear this stuff. Um, 
apoptosis, this is important stuff though, apoptosis basically means that your body can, and this happens when you're fasting, your body can come in and actually remove entire cells that are not functioning the way that they're supposed to. Um, so this would be the case, let's just say, for cancer cells. So all of us have cancer cells in our bodies at all times. Not to scare you, but our immune system can come in and clean that stuff up a lot of times. Obviously, and unfortunately, not all the time. So um, if you are fasting, you're giving your body that uh, upgraded chance to be able to come in and take out those cells. So apoptosis, your body comes in, a cell has mutated, it's growing out of control, your body can take that out, wipe it out. Okay, similarly, but slightly different, is autophagy. And what autophagy is, is your body can come in and take these cells that aren't so great, maybe they've started to show signs of aging, um, and they can actually pull the cells apart and recycle what's good and get rid of what's bad. Okay, it's fantastic, it's like so fascinating and amazing to me. So your body has this, uh, this amazing ability to heal itself if given the opportunity. And one of the things that we need to do to give it this opportunity is to take a break from eating. So again, you don't wanna work out 22 hours a day. You also don't wanna be eating nonstop for 22 hours a day. And you, don't, you also don't wanna be snacking every hour on the hour because you're not actually letting your body get into this um, mode in which it can do that super healing. Um, Joni says, my name is Joni and I'm a nerd. Yes, Joni. You're in good company, I'm a nerd too. Um, especially for science. So, um, yeah, this got a little deeper than I was planning, but that's a little bit of the science behind why we do the 12 hours of fasting, okay? That's why we're gonna be doing this in Transform Body and Mind. We start on Monday, I'm so excited. Um, but like I said, beyond that, you can't just tell someone just go fast for 12 hours without actually getting to the root cause of why they're it, eating so much at nighttime, they can't just you can't just pull it away from somebody, right? There's a whole like neuroscience behind why we do what we do and the and the um, the habit forming things and routines and um, all the things that go on in order for us to be able to actually adopt this lifestyle. So this program is about having the healthy lifestyle with the nutrition and fitness and also learning how to get there so that you don't stand in your own way because a lot of times we just self sabotage. We don't even know we're doing it, maybe we do, and then we just never get to that sustainable, lifelong um, uh, lifestyle that we're looking for, right? I think almost all of us can say that we want to be healthy and we want it to come pretty naturally to us. We don't wanna be thinking all the time about wh what we should eat and when we should eat. Um, we wanna be able to just do it and move on, live our lives and not be so obsessed about our food or our weight or all that stuff. So that's what's going on. Today's the last day to sign up for Transform Body and Mind. If this sounds like something that you could really use in your life, make sure you get it on it. Um, this will be the cheapest this program is ever running for because it is my beta launch, which is just a fancy way of saying. It's the first time I'm running this program. So um, I've priced it pretty low um, for what it is because I just felt like if you're gonna trust me in doing something that's brand new, um, I wanted to give you guys a little bit of a break on the price so that we can just all enjoy the first time together. And then um, when I launch it the next time, maybe in the fall or so, um, possibly I'll make some changes, we'll see, and um, it'll be back to its normal price. So make sure if this is something that you're interested in, this is going to be the best deal that you can get it for. Sign up, I'm gonna put it, the link in the comments. Um, and if you can't do it right now, no big deal, no sweat, keep coming up, come, showing up, watching my videos, um, and uh, you know, commenting, letting me know what's going on for you. And if you can, try to adapt the 12 hours overnight of fasting, okay? See how you feel and let me know. I would love to hear from you guys. Um, see you in the next video and enjoy the weekend. Bye guys.